you do? I'm Eilina Armstrong, a VP of Editorial for SC Media, and welcome to another SC In Focus happening at RSA. Here with me right now is Tom Kemp. He's CEO of Centrify. When you're speaking from a technological perspective overall, uh, and you spoke a little bit about identity, uh, certainly, and, and your users, what is the biggest issue that's facing enterprises? I think the biggest problem goes back to what I said before, yeah. is that the entirety of everyone's systems and applications, there's a, there's a weak point, which is the fact that most of these systems and applications, on-premise or in the cloud, are accessible by one thing, which is a password. And so what we've seen is that you really need to implement a maturity model uh, in which uh, that you start layering on things like multi-factor authentication, sure. that you consolidate identities, that you move to single sign-on, you implement the concept of lease privilege, uh, and then you also secure and manage the privileged accounts mm -hmm. uh, as well that have the key, proverbial keys to the kingdom. So we really believe that there needs to be uh, much more maturity as it relates to identity because the uh, top attack vector is now users because you know applications are pretty well secured, the network is getting pretty well secured. Obviously in a deprimerized world, uh, you can't control the network because it's on the public internet. Sure. And so now you have to shift focus to the user. Is it really Tom accessing the application? You need to start taking into account things such as user behavior analytics. You need to be leveraging biometrics for multi-factor authentication. So I think that's really kind of where the next wave of security is shifting the focus from securing apps and infrastructure to shifting focus on the user and validating whether or not it really is the user and providing additional forms of strong authentication to validate that. So companies are spending millions, billions of dollars. I think you found Seven, billion. Seventy-five billion dollars, according to Gartner Group. It's oh, just amazing. Yeah. So. They're spending all this money and all these security solutions, services. Yep. When is enough enough? You know, the interesting thing is, is that you got $75 billion being spent on security, right? Mm -hmm. And security spending is growing 10%, but the actual attacks and breaches are growing at a greater percentage than what's being put in. So I, I fundamentally believe there re really needs to be a rethink of security, right? and focus on what are the top tack vectors. Because I really think a lot of your, your readers are still probably fighting last year's war, which is trying to harden the perimeter, et cetera. And we're now, here we are at the Cloud Security Alliance. It's more about cloud. And the attack vector is more about going after the users and identity. And if you look at all the latest breaches, you look at the John Podesta DNC, you look at the Office of Personnel Management, um, and all the top breaches, it's really because it's been going through the users, stealing through credentials, getting in, and then finding the privileged accounts that have the keys to the kingdom as well. So I think there needs to be a reset that what currently, where people are spending their money and spending the time is not working. The problem's actually getting worse. And so I fundamentally believe there needs to be a rethink in security and it needs to focus more on the user and layering on additional forms of authentication locking down privileged accounts, et cetera. Um, and I think what you'll see is that, that if you're able to do that, that you can actually decrease the amount of uh, breach activity happening within the organization. And a recent Forrester report actually proves that. Very good. Thank you so much, well, Tom. Thank you I really very appreciate much. you being here with us. All right. And thank you everyone for joining us for this SCN Focus. Uh, we'll see you next time.